So I picked genetic counseling because it sits at the perfect intersection of the hard sciences and then getting to communicate that to people and have them actually be able to make changes in their health based on that information. I chose Baylor for a lot of reasons, but I think the biggest one was the access to the different clinical sites here in Houston at the Texas Medical Center. Being able to see patients who are of all ages, all creeds, all backgrounds, and in all kinds of different languages. Houston is the most diverse city in the United States. I think for me, diversity is having a lot of different people coming from a lot of different places. So those can be different backgrounds, different upbringings, that can be a different racial experience, um, a different religious experience. But I think when we have all those things together and we're able to learn from each other, that creates a much richer experience. I'm married, I have a son. It's a lot when you think about balancing your family and a program like this that requires a lot of attention, but I'm very lucky. My family is very supportive. My husband helps out a lot. This is something I really wanted to do and this was my goal. And so my family has really, far from being something that holds me back, been an asset going forward. I think having a relationship with my classmates is the thing some mornings that helps me get up here and get it done. My classmates are wonderful. We are sort of a hodgepodge of students. Some of us are older and have worked before. Some of us are new grads and everyone falls somewhere in the middle. And so I think for us having different experiences and all being involved in this program together, I mean they're my biggest allies. We have a rich um, legacy of genetics practice here in Houston, especially at Baylor. So I think coming here, you shouldn't be worried that it's new, but you should be excited that we finally have this program in a place where we've been studying in genetics for so long.